Kim Kardashian Hollywood game starts off with your boss telling you to go fold some clothes and lock the cash register. Pretty much, I don't even understand why he's telling you this. Like, if you show up to a job, why are you showing up after the store closes? Anyways, whatever. So, you obey by his orders. You lock up the cash register, fold up some clothes, collect some level up points, and then when you leave the store, you see Kim Kardashian, who's having a total fashion emergency, and you allow her inside. She searches around, asks you, she wants something quick but cute, and you, your fashion savvy self, have to pick out her outfit. I usually choose the red dress. Anyways, she invites you to a photo shoot that she's going to, tells you to dress up, so you have to go on your way back to your house, which doesn't look too cool. I mean, it's pretty empty till you figure out what to do with your money. You can maybe put some money aside to buy some more stuff. So you go through your wardrobe, look for the perfect outfit, which you probably won't be able to find in the beginning of the game. It chooses for you. Either way, she's going to think you look amazing. So you find out that the photo shoot is actually a surprise for you and you're about to do a profile shot. So you get ready, put on some makeup, click on those blue dots everywhere, collect some stuff, level up yourself. And Kim at the end will tell to you and talk to you, be like, oh my gosh, she looks so cool. You should come to our party afterwards in the bar or I don't even know, bar or cafe, it looks like a cafe to me. So when you get there and meeting this guy, uh, Willow's ex, which you don't really know about yet, and then Kim shows up, tells you that she's gonna set you up with a manager, which is super cool, so obviously you have to accept. You leave and Willow is yelling at you for talking to her ex, which is an ex, so like, who cares? Anyways, she's not even important. You meet Simon and he tells you that he wants you to do some headshots and then he'll probably end up taking you on. So this is a really big break for you. You cannot ruin this. So afterwards, you go to that photo shoot. You waste the rest of your energy doing it. And then you rock it and you go back and tell him and he takes you on as his manager. The Kim Kardashian Hollywood game is such an amazing game. It teaches you about fame, fortune, and the struggles of having a relationship. It's a pretty, pretty amazing game. It's so addictive. I've been playing it for so many years. I've been spending so much money on it. Like, thank goodness I found that hack. Anyways, I think The Sims 4 is a lot better because there's so much you can do. You can get custom content. Make your sense look realistic, get some clothes, mods, make the game even more amazing. And it is so, 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 so much more addictive. And you could get it right now because it is on sale for $15, which is a lot less than uh, Kim Kardashian packs, K-Star packs, and money packs. So I'd get it. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I'm really, really, really sorry for you um, Apple users. I was not able to find the hack for you, but I'm telling you The Sims 4 is a lot worth it. You're able to get custom content, which means better looking Sims, better clothes, so whole variety. Then they're all free, free CC, free mods, and it's just amazing to make the game a lot more interesting for you, even though you're just gonna, even if you're gonna end up having the base game which is on sale right now for $15, which is a lot less than the majority of the K-Star packs and money packs in the Kim Kardashian Hollywood game. Up here is going to be a card section, so please guys go there, vote for what video you want to see next. Thank you so much again. Remember to stay safe, stay positive, and see ya.